Pop the top, it's time for the video to drop, and hint to who day, bring us episode 12 of that WWE 2K20, my career thing. And while in the last episode it was a little bit shorter today, I will ensure that it is going to be a long one. So sit back, kick back, relax, because it is time for the Royal Rumble pay-per-view. So without further ado, let's go ahead and talk to Trey, a.k.a. Dalty D up in the limousine. So what number did you get for the Royal Rumble match? Two. Oh. Oh, well, that's a really tough draw. But I'm sure lots of people have won from that spot. Wait, is that piece of paper with your number on it folded in half? Oh, yeah, it is. It's not two. It's 23. Oh. Okay. Now I like your chances a little better. Not that I was doubting you before. <laughs> After I win the Rumble, I can't wait to watch you put Brooklyn in her place once and for all. She may have gotten the better of me in the past, but tonight's different. She has to step into my ring. Yeah. My only concern is she might pull something cheap, like having Samoa Joe get involved. I'll make sure that doesn't happen. By the way, have you seen Sin Cara? I think I owe him an apology. Why? When I thought I drew number two, I may have thrown a slight tantrum and damaged his mini trampoline. I'm not sure he even knows how to get into the ring without that. I think he'll manage for one night. Besides, we have bigger things to worry about. Okay. Oh, snap. Royal Rumble. Tyler Breeze eliminating Otis. Take it. Take it, take it, take it, Adam Cole, baby. Adam Cole about to toss Breeze and Otis over. Yep, they're gone. Goodbye, Otis and Tyler Breeze. Okay, that's dope. That was dope. I like that. Who's next? Damn, they both got dropped. How y'all feel right now? Who is it? Who is it? Oh, it's Sin Cara. Okay, I thought it was going to be us. That's cool, I guess. Sin Cara. You, wait, what? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what? Sin Cara just died. <laughs> Bro, what? Sin Cara just got taken out, yo. Oh my god. When in doubt, stall it out, I guess, with the Adam Cole baby chant. This has got to be us, right? Hey, let's get it, man. Let's get it. On our way to the ring. Sorry, man. That's that's on me. <laughs> okay, I guess he screwed up the trampoline. Here we go. Oh, duck underneath. Oh, win the Royal Rumble by eliminating all of your opponents. All right. Well, we know the... Okay, the game did not make me sell that at all. So, uh, I will gladly... Uh, yeah, I'll gladly just, you know, no sell. That's fine. Big forearm. Come on. Oh, I went for the multiple. Oh, you tried, Adam Cole. You really did. Who's next? Do I have to eliminate everybody by myself? Is that what the objective is? Because if that's the objective, that's kind of whack. Oh, God. I meant to, uh, you know, hit that reverse little forearm, but uh, missed it. Oh, my God. The uppercuts are fast. Oh, that Chop City, baby. That's our first time seeing Seth in my career, I believe. If I'm not mistaken, yeah. I think this is our first time seeing Seth. I swung and I missed. <laughs> that's wild. Go up behind him. German suplex. Oh. Drop that man. What the hell? Did y'all see Seth Rollins like twirl a little bit off, the, off that cell real quick? All right, come on. I have no reversals. I, so or I have like one reversal slot, so I'm going to try not to reverse for a little bit. Are y'all really just going to jump me? Elias. Walk with Elias. All right, there we go. Nice counter. Nice counter. Lift this man up real quick. Oh, I did not know I got to crack the dome. Oops. Did not mean for that to happen. Go after Elias. Oh, my God. He just dropped us. Jesus. I didn't realize I got a finisher off of that, or else I would not have gone for Crack the Dome right there. I thought we still had the signature. That's why I was trying to go for the aneurysm. I should have paid more attention, but it'd be like that sometimes, I suppose. All right. 
Come on, what's up, Elias? What's up with you? Oh, God, Seth. Seth just murdered him because of that. All right, let's toss Adam Cole out. Oh, it's Big E. It's a new day. Yes, it is. Goodbye, Adam. Goodbye, Adam. Goodbye, Adam. Goodbye, Adam. Goodbye, Adam. Get up, Elias. Come on now. What's up? No, Elias. Damn it. Oh, God. He tried to eliminate us like that, man. That would have been bad. That would have been very bad. Oh, we do not have any reversals. This is not good. This is not good. Oh, God. Ooh, I'm nervous. The cheeks were clenched right there. Who's next? Velveteen Dream. D-R-E-A-M. He is. The dream is here, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, God. Oh, Elias, you tried it. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no, no. Son of a beast. Oh, thank God, Elias is stupid. Oh, God. God, that would have sucked. That would have been awful. I don't think we need to eliminate everybody either, by the way. I think we're good when it comes to that. I think they just want us to win. But it does say eliminate all of your opponents. So, like, I kind of also think we might need... What the... F all right, I was like, what just happened? Oh, that's that definitely looks new, the elimination gimmick. But, I mean, I think it's the same principle as, like, before. All right, come on, Seth. You're next. Oh, goodbye. And no, why are we doing a damn try? Why are we trying to do the DDT animation? I literally just want to throw him out. Brian is now here. Okay. Look, Big E, I love you, brother, but you got to get out the damn ring. Come on. No, Seth. Motherfucker, yo. Are you kidding me, Seth? I'm out here trying to get eliminated. Why is everyone going after me, man? What the fuck? Everyone's literally coming after me right now. This is stupid. This is dumb. All right. Seth, you're literally hitting Velveteen Dream, and he's still targeting me. Okay. That's fine. Whatever. Oh, man. Th guys, if you're watching this, I'm recording this pretty much right after I recorded my 2K20 Bump in the Night uh, showcase video yesterday that dropped. So I'm still a little aggravated right now. Oh, uh, get out. Get out. Velveteen Dream! Oh, my God, man. Let me do my thing. Shit. All right. Can I get my reversal slot back? Because I do not like this right now. Why is everybody targeting me? This is so stupid, man. Oh, my God. There we go. Come on, Rollins. Get out. Nope. Of course. It'd be like that. All right. And our reversals take forever to come back. So I'm not expecting that ish to come back for a while. Standing moonsault. Damn, that was a low-ass standing moonsault. Please get the reversal. There we go. Oh, there we go. Come on, Rollins. Get the hell out the ring. Get the hell out. Get the hell out. All right. Come on. Come on. Come on. Damn it. He's going to get out. You hate to see it. You really do. Oh, Kevin Owens. Lit. All right. I'm just running away. Whatever. I don't even care at this point. I'm just, I'm just dodging. Ducking and dodging. Oh, I went for Crack the Dome. Oh, my God. What a drop kick. Kevin, please no. I love you, bud. Please don't. Please don't. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Kevin. Thank you, Kevin. Oh, God. What? How the? Okay. You know what? Whatever. That doesn't make any sense, but okay. Can you just, you know? Okay, Kevin. So, I think we don't have to eliminate everyone. We just have to win the match. So, knowing that now, I'm going to just do this early recovery joint, and I'm just going to stay here. I'm going to stay here until somebody comes after me because I want to build my reversal stocks back up. So, all right. All right, Brian. You're uh, you're getting up against the ropes, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to need to go ahead and go for you, DDT. There we go. All right, Rollins. You have been a thorn in my side this entire damn match. God damn. Like, that ass. He has been a thorn in my side this entire match. <laughs> it's kind of crazy. Oh, God damn it. Here we go with this. Oh, thank God, Kevin Owens. Thank God, Kevin Owens. Oh, thank God. Kevin Owens just saved my life you love to see that you really really love to see that good stuff kevin good stuff he really just saved us right there and goodbye brian are we the last ones i think i think it's literally coming down to me and rollins oh get up aneurysm yeet there we go because no one else is coming out so i mean i'm assuming we're the last ones and goodbye rollins do we not have a rumble finisher? I guess we don't have a rumble finisher. Cool. Ah, can we get this elimination? 
man. I don't think we're going to be able to. I don't think we're going to be able to. We're not. Okay, now there's still one more. Who is it? Who's the last man? Who's the last man? Ricochet. That's dope. That's sick. I like that. I like the ricochet is last. That's really cool. He is the one and only. Oh! Well, what? What? Uh, ricochet? Hello? Are you okay? You okay, Ricochet? <laughs> this man was tweaking. Damn. All right. Come on, Ricochet. You're the last one. You are the last one, Ricochet. We are down to just you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, damn. He got back in real quick. All right. There we go. We, we're just going to get our reversals up. We're going we're gonna to play this smart. We're going to play this smart right now. We're going to play this very, very smart. Yeet. Oh, we missed the elbow drop. No. Damn it. Okay. Okay. We're still good. We're still okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Woo. I thought he was about to just try to throw us out like that. I was very nervous right there. I was very, very nervous right there. Okay. Can we get a counter off, please? Hello? Okay, okay. Just, you know, it feels like they switched up the reversal timing right now on me. Okay, cool. Like, why is that move so fast? Jesus. That move was, like, unnecessarily fast for no reason. There we go. Two. And one more. Let's go. Wait, what? Oh, there we go. What? The rock? Did y'all just see that target? I'm confused. We're the Royal Rumble winners. Let's get it. What? There was 30. What? Is that national security? Wait. Wait. Oh, snap. It's the President of the United States of America with a bald Triple H and a generic Miz to his left. <laughs> or his right, excuse me. I guess The Rock, the President of the United States, is now in the Royal Rumble match. Okay. Okay. I like it. I like it. What's up, though? What's up with you, Rock? What's up? I did not expect... I say I don't expect that, but, like, the targeting kind of spoiled it for me. So, eh, it'd be like that, I guess. That's kind of crazy, though. The president of the United States is in the Royal Rumble match. It's crazy that he's the president, by the way. That's wild. Oh, snap. All right, Rock. Man, don't throw the arm up, too. Getting a whole ass entrance in the Royal Rumble. But the, the 30 people already came out. This ain't even fair. Damn, look at the Rock. If you smell what the Rock is cooking. Bounce. Come on, Rock. Can we get to it? Can we just toss him over? Like, why are we not just tossing him over? <laughs> like, really, just run up behind him, push him over, and let him hit the floor. We don't have to have this match. We can just eliminate him right then and there. Come on, now. You should have used your noodle. Oh, well, I guess we're in a match with the Rock. Oh! Win the Royal Rumble by eliminating the Rock. Easy. Aneurysm. Please don't counter. Let's go. He didn't counter. All right. So I thought we were done when we eliminated Ricochet. Now we got Dwayne to eliminate. All right. Come on. Come on. Two more. Let's go. Woo. And they got Secret Service to grab the rock. Let's get it, man. Picking up that big Royal Rumble win. I'm coming for that title. Joey Samoa Samoa Joey. What's up, man? I ain't got no rematch clause, but you know what I did get? You know what I did get? I did get a Royal Rumble win and a WrestleMania main event. Wait, what's The Rock doing? What's The Rock doing? Dwayne, what are you doing? Oh, stare down. Stare down. Oh, let's go. One on one with the great one. Oh, putting our arm in the air, too. You love to see it. Appreciate you, Dwayne. Appreciate you, Mr. President. Appreciate you, Rock. There's so many names to call him. 
<laughs> oh, man. It's crazy he's the president. Watch him rock bottom us still. <laughs> oh, okay. Why'd you have to do that? Hey, we get to cross off to win the Royal Rumble on the list, I believe. Yeah, we did. All right, cool. Here we go. Divas Championship on the line. Brooklyn Von Braun versus Haiti Hendricks. What's up, Brooklyn? What's up, Brooklyn? Whoa, damn, she countered. And I uh, I have a little bit of word that uh, Haiti Hendricks may have have may has a new signature and a new finisher too. So not only do we have front hand, back hand, but uh, uh, we got new a new thing too. What? Oh, shooting star press. You know, psychology is out the window when it comes to Haiti Hendricks. Y'all are used to it by now. Let's be honest here. Get up. Get out, Brooklyn. And you know, actually, you know what? We ain't even gonna do that. We ain't gonna do all that because we 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 wanna we wanna fight Brooklyn Von Braun. I don't know why I went for Hurricane Ron if I'm trying to just fight her, but I mean, you know what I'm saying. All right, can we get can we get a counter off? No, we can't because we have a status effect. You hate, and then she's just gonna stomp us out. Mm, okay. Okay. Oh my God! Then she kicks in the damn gut. All right. What? She gonna lift us up to a kneeling position? This is for the Divas title. This is a big opportunity to cross a, a weird item off the list. Not a weird item. It's just an item you didn't think you were gonna cross off the list because, well. The Divas Championship hasn't been instated in years. Whoop, counter. What's up, Brooklyn? Oh, thrust kick. And ja What? Kick to the gut, counter. Spin her around, another thrust kick. Yes, sir. Oh, okay. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. That's definitely not what I wanted to do, but okay. Drop kick. Oh, my God. That power bomb was sick. Oh, my God. That power bomb counter was so brutal. Let's go. We just gotta get her to yellow health, which I think we're about to do. Yep, we just did it. All right, what's next? Puncher, perform a strike. All right, boom, oh boom, oh 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 boo! Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, come on, come on, keep the strikes going. Let's go. Oh, spear through the middle and bottom rope. Okay. I mean, it's not a Royal Rumble match, but damn, are we hurt? Are we hurt? What? Excuse me? Oh, snap. Samoa Joe watching this match from the back. I can only assume he's going to try to help out Brooklyn Von Braun. Psych. Let's get it. Come on, Joe. I ain't going to let you do that, Joe. I can't let you do that, Joe. Uh-uh. It won't happen. Not today. No way, no how. You might be the WWE champion, but damn it, I just won the Royal Rumble. How you feel? Come, Really? Okay. That's fine. Oh, God. That jab, though. No. No. Damn it. Threw us against the table. No. Oh, my God. Here we go again. Don't want to be more than friends. All right. Duck underneath. Nope. He countered. Son of a beast. Kip up. Hello. Yeet. DDT on the floor. All right, Joe, I'm going to need you to follow me, all right? Follow me, follow me, set me free. from the city. Follow me, set me free. Come to the parking lot so I can crack your dome right now. I'm going to do, do it, yeah. All right, come on. He's going to counter it. Oh, my God. He didn't even try to counter. He just backfisted us. Jesus. Nice counter. Nice counter. Drop Ooh. that man down to reverse DDT. All right, come on, Joe. Oh, he don't got no counters. He ain't got no counters. Look at that status effect. How ironic, Joe. What's up? Yeet. What? Okay. Winner. D okay, can you get that off screen while I'm trying to throw him in the car, please? There we go. I was like, bro, what's going on here? We're, we are kidnapping Samoa Joe. Is that's what's happening here? We're just gonna kidnap Samoa Joe. Okay. Okay. And slam the car down. <laughs> All right. I mean, I guess we just kidnapped Samoa Joe. Granted, I mean, it's not really kidnapping. More so just trapping him, I suppose. Oh, snap. We're back. I thought it was over. I'm not gonna lie to you. I thought it was honestly over. Referee had a count of seven. They're both trying to get to their feet. The referee got a count of eight. Come on now. Nine. Oh, we just broke the count. Let's go. Let's go. See, I thought this was it. I thought that spear was over, and I was like, really? That's how this match ends that quick, too? Damn. All right, what's up? 
Win the match. Why are we targeting the ref? Excuse me. <laughs> I don't know why we were targeting the ref and just crack the damn ref, but all right. Win the match by pinfall submission. So that's all we got to do. So, yeah, the new signature and finisher uh, will be debuted in this damn match. You best believe. Oh, damn. She's left us up. Oh, you really tried for that, huh? You really... Throw that thrust. What? Uh, okay, I guess. Springboard. Yeet. There we go. See, uh, with this whole Brooklyn Von Braun match, like I said, I just want to beat the hell out of her. So I might still front hand backhand her. But uh, I do know without a shout of a damn doubt, we are going to that new. Oh, my God. That DDT is so vicious, man. I love when it gets hit because it looks so good. The kip up to it is probably my favorite part. Lift up and back suplex. There we go. What's up, Brooklyn? Come on now. You got to put a little bit of fight in yourself if you're going to be an MMA star. What's up? Whip her off. Yep. Hit her with a little bit of that. Drop down and get your eagle on. Leapfrog. Oh, German suplex. Dropping her right on her damn neck. Oh, Tope Connie low. Tope Connie low at the Royal Rumble. Tope Con. Mother trucker. I don't know why I always do that. Like, I know I'm supposed to wait, and I still go early, and it still doesn't let you do it. It's so stupid. It'd be like that. Whip her over, and German suplex. Oh, drop her on her neck. Oh, we got that signature, though. I don't think we're going to be able to hit it because, you know, they only like the counter signatures and uh, finishers, but it'd be like that. Can we get it? Oh, we can. Yeet. Oh, we actually got it. Let's go. Oh, round the post. And now time for the finisher. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Come on. There we go. Springboard. 6.30. Oh, God, she rolled out the way. One, two, two and a half. Let's go. Nice kick out. Nice kick out. Oh, my God. She countered the springboard 6.30, which is now Haiti Hendricks' finisher. She, we, can, we can firmly call her the Fresh Princess of Midair again. You'll love to see it. And we just died off of that damn DDT. Can we put our arm over? Just put your arm over. What are you doing? There we go. Count it, Ruff. Count it. One. Damn, she kicked out at one. <laughs> I didn't expect the match to end right there, to be honest. But at the same time, God, I kind of thought a two count would have been, you know, suffice. Would have been justified. There we go. Nice little kick to the gut. Thrust kick. Oh, my God. This ain't a thrust kick. This is a kick to the damn face. Get up. Thrust kick. No, she countered. Oh, God. Duck underneath. Come back through. Pull her in. No, they lock up. She shoots us back. Come back through. No, oh, there we go. Nice counter. Nice counter. Get up, Brooklyn. Oh, we don't got no counters. That might not have been good. Might not have been a good idea. Yeah. Might not have been my best idea yet. Ooh. That's a big ooh. Yep, because there's the signature. And she's going to go for the finisher right after, too. More than likely. Oh, damn. She's going for a straight pin. One, two. I cannot see that damn meter. That is so hard to see. Oh, my God. All right, let's counter this. Oh, we got it. Let's go. Let's go. We countered it. DDT. Can you kip up? You have instant recovery. Why is it? Okay. Whatever. I'm not going to complain. I'm not going to complain. She countered. Oh, of course. <laughs> of course. Kip up, please. Thank you. And yeet. Meteora. Go straight to that apron. She has no reversals. This should connect flush without a question. Springboard, 630. Oh, my God. We just murdered her. Go for the pin, please. Just go for the pin. Let's get it. Take me home, country road. One, two. Okay. Okay. I understand. I, I completely understand. I get it. I, I, I get it, you know. Brooklyn Von Braun, very, very strong MMA fighter. You know, a 630, it's not going to take her out. I understand. Uh, you know, it, it makes a lot of sense, I suppose. It, like, what, what was I thinking, you know? You, what was I thinking? You know, a springboard 630. Come on now. What was I thinking? That actually connected. Oh, my God. If you guys are new to the series, I've been trying to hit that spot for so damn long since starting up this series, and it finally connects. I am so surprised. Bro, the combos right now with Haiti. But I feel like, I feel like right now, it's time for one thing and one thing only. A little bit of front hand, a little bit of back. Oh, she countered. So we countered right back, though. Get up. Yep. Pull her in. Lift her up. And drive her down with a nice power bomb. Roll her out, too. Oh, you good? You folded up like an accordion right now, Brooklyn. 
All right, there we go. Back suplex. Yep, drop on a stack of dimes. She calls a neck. And standing shooting star. And we can hit this now, too. Yep. Lion salt. I don't know why I said it like that. Don't mind me. <laughs> Lift her up. And chop city, baby. Oh, we missed. We missed. We missed. Ba oh, no. Hurricane Rana. Yep. Woo. There we go. Get up. Get up. Because it's time. It's time, Brooklyn. It's time. If you you either getting up in the oh she getting up all the way too she getting up all the way too Whoa, wait come on go for your sig there we go she flipped this out and elbow here we go around the world big time kick we're on the apron now but I don't ah uh, this she's gonna roll she did I knew it I knew it I called it man oh no oh let's go oh my god that was nerve wracking that was so nerve wracking. Oh, let's go. We countered that, too. Lift her up. Back suplex for you. Oh. Come on. Get up, Brooklyn. Get up, Brooklyn. It's time. It's time. A little bit of front hand, a little bit of back hand. And that's it. That's all she wrote. Counter out. One, two, three. Let's go. New Divas champion. Crossing another list off the damn bucket list. Across another item off. I can't speak. It really be like that. Haiti Hendricks, however, your new Divas champion. Let's get it. Another list item checked off. Whoa, that scared me. <laughs> I thought it was Samoa Joe for a second. <laughs> I don't know why. Oh, she's signing it on the title, too. That's hilarious. New Divas champion, Royal Rumble winner. What a night here at the Royal Rumble pay per view. I knew you'd be here early. You always were an overachiever. You here to demand your rematch? Because I have no problem beating you again tonight. There's not gonna be a rematch. You're giving up that easily? No, there's not going to be a rematch because you're going to announce your retirement tonight. <laughs> That's news to me. It's why I wanted to find you first thing, so you could start writing your big farewell speech. But that kind of emotional garbage should actually come easily to you. I mean, if you get stuck, you could just borrow something from your earlier writing. You've probably asked yourself a million times, why? Why didn't they want to be my parents? The truth is, we did, but we had to make the hardest decision of our lives because we didn't feel we could give you the life you deserved. Garbage, garbage, garbage. Love always, your mom and dad. That's right. I found out you wrote that little piece of fiction kicking off 20 years of lies to your best friend. His real parents are dead, and you've been stringing him along this entire time, making him think they're alive just so you'd have one friend in your depressing life. You never told him the truth, even when he continued to pathetically leave two empty seats for them that would never be filled. Why? Why are you doing this? Because you're an the asshole. Why doesn't really matter. Right now, you should be more concerned with the what, as in what could happen next. I could expose you and all your lies, destroying your life, your reputation, and most of all, your friendship with Trey. Or you can retire immediately, and I'll make your secret my secret. But one way or another, it's happening tonight. I know walking away from everything you've worked for will be the hardest thing you've ever done, but you have to keep our secret. Please. Damn. She's mad. It's your fault, though. And that's how I won the WWE Divas Championship, crossing off one of the most Look, elusive that. things on be. the list. I but the, the Divas moment. Championship that's wasn't that. just a title. That's my mom right there. It was more than that. It was uh, sorry. I, I think something amazing just happened uh, earlier today. I received a note saying I would finally get to meet my birth parents at the Hall of Fame ceremony tonight, and I I think they just arrived. What? I don't know I, what's I, happening I apologize either. If I'm a little distracted. Who are those just, people? I've been waiting for this, this moment my entire life. We're, we're almost done here, so I'll catch up with you real soon, okay? Uh, sorry again for cutting you off. Where were you? There's really not much left to say other than to cover how we ended up here tonight.
When I defeated my lifelong nemesis to capture this championship, the same championship I dreamed of winning as a young girl, it was an amazing feeling. But after that wore off, I was consumed by a range of different emotions, ones that I hadn't felt in a very long time. Satisfaction, relief, peace of mind, the fire that drove me throughout my career to come out here and fight on a nightly basis was suddenly gone. I went from thinking, what's next, to what's left. And I realized that after crossing off the most elusive item on the list, the answer was not much. Because I accomplished everything I set out to do and way more. So I had to be honest with myself. If I kept going, everything after would feel like a letdown. And that's not how I want to live my life or remember my career. So with all that being said, I'm here tonight to relinquish the Divas Championship and announce my retirement from WWE effective immediately. What? She really didn't want to tell him. What an asshole, yo. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> you were not a good person. I know this is probably shocking and some of you might be disappointed or upset, but this isn't necessarily a bad thing. I've lived this part of my life to the fullest, and now it's time for me to go explore other challenges. And who knows? Maybe I'll try acting again. <laughs> you all saw how my only other audition went. Can't go worse than that, right? <laughs> Finally, I just want to say thank you. Thank you for supporting me for all these years. Please continue to back the next women who take my place, who I am certain will be stronger, more athletic, and hopefully a little less temperamental than I was. <clears throat> so, yeah, that's it. Thanks, everyone. Bro. She really chose to retire instead of just telling her friend that his parents are dead. A secret she's kept for over 20... How do you... Red's not a likable character. <laughs> I don't understand how you could like her. I really don't. She's not a likable character. <laughs> at all. I see no redeeming qualities. What? <laughs> I thought there was going to be a feel-good moment. Not really feel good, but I thought there was going to be a moment of her just telling him. Or, like, maybe letting it you choose, but no. They said, bump it. She's just going to be a shitty person. And continue to lie. What? What was that? You can't retire. You've got years left on your career. I'm sorry, but I need you to try to understand. Maybe I could wrap my head around it if I had a little more warning. I mean, when you texted me, make sure you watch my promo tonight, I was expecting you had some clever line about Brooklyn, not that you were going to walk away from WWE. This wasn't something I was planning for a long time. It happened quickly. Okay, fine. But if you're done, then I'm done. We're a package deal, remember? No, what? Don't do this. I need you to try to understand. What about the title shot you just earned in the Royal Rumble? And getting revenge on Samoa Joe for everything he's done. None of that matters if you're not along for the ride, too. You need to think about this some more. You're making an impulsive decision. I've made up my mind. I'm done. Bro, what? I never expected my plan to work this well and cause your idiot friend to retire, too. It's like getting rid of two turds with one stone. This isn't over. But it is over. And that's the best part of all of this. Anyway, just wanted to wish you a happy early retirement. Maybe you can take up bingo or going to dinner at 3 p.m. or yelling at kids in your neighborhood. 
If you kick that ball in my yard one more time, I'm going to put you on my list. <laughs> Hilarious. See you, uh, never again. We're going live with your show intro in five minutes. Thanks. Uh, just let me run through it once to make sure I've got it. <clears throat> Who will be named as your top ten? Prepare yourself for drama as our contestants get their hands dirty, glad <laughs> handing with the CEO of a manure company to see who can get the upper hand for their fall fertilizer campaign. It's all hands on deck. Coming up next on America's next top hand model. Do you think there's too many hand puns? It's perfect. It's not heavy handed at all. <laughs> I see what you did there. <laughs> hey, hey, sorry I missed your other call. I'm at my new hosting gig look if this is about getting baron corbin a spot on the show i'm still relatively new here so i don't think i have that kind of pull yet oh okay good because honestly i don't think baron's hands are anything to write home about <laughs> wait what'd you say really that that's amazing did you tell red yet yeah she's been hard to reach lately okay i'll, I'll try her this is truly an honor thank you so much Ah, ooh, ah, oh, yeah, ooh, 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 I'm gonna be famous, or I'm gonna be famous, or. <laughs> <laughs> yes! That's my ring and my championship. I hate you, Brooklyn. Is she drunk? What? Hey, it's been a while. How's it going? I'm great. I'm on vacation at the beach, which is why no one's been able to reach me. I'm trying to disconnect, you know? Oh, that's good to hear. I only have a minute, so I'll make this quick. I just got some amazing news. We're going into the WWE Hall of Fame together. Oh, snap. Really? Wow, I I'm shocked. I mean, I thought it would happen someday, but definitely not this fast. They didn't say this, but I'm assuming they want to capitalize on my crossover appeal as host of ANTHM. I'm sure that's it. I know we didn't expect our careers to end the way they did, but it's nice to know we accomplished enough to go into the Hall of Fame. And more importantly, we're going in together just like it's always been. Yeah, it is nice. Hey, I gotta run. Don't relax too much. You know what they say about idle hands. Ooh, I gotta work that into tonight's show. Congrats. You too. Ooh, I wish I could see Brooklyn's reaction. <laughs> I'm sure she won't be happy. Which makes me happy. <laughs> Mouth! Don't look at me, don't that look at me! Totally God, <laughs> are you kidding me? Those two pieces of human trash are going into the Hall of Fame? This has to be a joke! They were only in the WWE for a cup of coffee. You know what? An actual cup of coffee deserves to be inducted before they do! Ah! Take it easy. We're all entitled to our opinions, but there are certain realities you can't dispute. While Red and Trey may have had shorter careers than the typical Hall of Famer, the impact they made during that time was tremendous. So it doesn't matter if you or anyone else disagrees, they are going to get the recognition they deserve. We'll see about that. What? Man, feels like we've been up here for like 15 hours. Hope everyone's still with us. But uh, I think that pretty much sums everything up, right? Yeah, I think we covered it all. And there's only one thing left to do. List, please. Oh snap. It's time to cross off one final list item together. Get inducted into the WWE Hall of Fame. Let's get it. The Shoot, last item on the list. Seriously, I've got one you can use. I I'm sure someone else in this arena has a spare pen, so you can go sit down. Take it easy just wanted to come up here in front of the world to say congratulations and finally put our differences behind us. I would never do anything to take away from your special night that you so rightfully deserve. Trey, even your birth parents are here, which is amazing. Stand up, please. But before you finish up, there's just one thing I want to mention that you left out of your speech. You see, Red wasn't 100% honest about what led to her retirement and later her best friends. In fact, 
It turns out she has a little secret, which is the real reason she walked away from WWE. You have to do something. She's gonna ruin everything. I'm sorry, but I'm done hiding this for us. It's over. What really happened was I found out the truth behind this secret, and she didn't want me to tell anyone. So she chose to retire instead. But I couldn't sit back and let her get away without everyone knowing the real Red. So let's start with this. That lovely older couple in the audience, they're not Trey's parents. I know, because they're fakes I hired to be here. That letter you got that said they were coming tonight, also a fake. But if you want to see your real parents, I can make that happen. Here they are. Bro, that what? Says it all. And look at the date there. They were already long gone by the time we were in high school. Which makes you wonder, Trey. How could they have written you a letter? Maybe someone else wrote it to try to manipulate you into doing whatever they wanted. And maybe that person was so miserable and lonely, they had to resort to something morbid like that to ensure they always had a friend at their side. But who would do such a terrible thing? Certainly not your so-called best friend, right? Is this true? Damn. We're not finished here. What? For, really? <sighs> if you come any closer, I will crush his neck. And the same goes for anyone else. If you try to stop us, I will end him. Damn. Oh, word. Oh, we about to fight. Oh, we are going to fight. Get Brooklyn up while staying away from Samoa Joe. Okay, so we can't go near Joe because if we go near Joe, Joe will murder us. Dude, Brooklyn Von Braun done threw up the cemetery picture. Like, what the hell? That was way too extra, yo. Dude, we're fighting at the fucking Hall of Fame. Oh, Spine Buster. I was not prepared for this. We still got the ruby red slippers on. No, 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 no. What? Okay. Can we not T-Rex arm at the damn Hall of Fame, please? Like, come on now. There we go. Nice arm drag. Boom. Damn it, yo. Is Brooklyn Von Braun got like a tank OP on right now or something? Okay. And then we can't grapple her. That's cool. There we go. We should be able to get her to yellow health easily now, right? Because, I mean, she doesn't have anything else. So, or in terms of like reversals or anything. So, this should be easy, right? Oh, there we go. Oh, big forearm. Yeet. Oh, damn. Into the LED board. Who was that? <gasps> Rhea! Oh, now we got to get Rhea? Oh, God, we missed Rhea. <laughs> Yo, Rhea's saucy right now. Can we talk about that? The, the all-white drip on Rhea real quick. All right, yo, 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 yo. We got to stay away from Joe. We got to stay away from Joe. Nope, oh, there we go. German. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Kill him. All right, get out, Rhea. What's up? Yo, look at what she's wearing, though. You love to see that. All right, throw her all the way over here just to get her away from Joe. You know what I'm saying? All right, we got to get her to yellow health. Who else is going to come up on the damn stage? Like, she's just going to come out of nowhere. Like, okay, guys, you know what? I want to be involved. I want to do this. <laughs> That's hilarious, yo. Oh, get her with that chop, though. Get her with that chop. You know what? I'm kind of surprised they didn't try to do, like, the IRL, like, uh, Hall of Fame from this year. Because they did that in a ring. And I feel like it would have made these cutscenes a little bit better. Oh, big forearm. Oh, another one. Dropping her down at the Hall of Fame. Who's left? Son of a bitch. All right. Come on, Becky. What's up? Oh, there we go. So we're just going to keep doing the same old thing, I guess, of getting them to yellow health while we're fighting the hell out of them. Get up. Get up. What's up? Oh, look at Becky's drip, too. That's, that's lit. I'm, 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 I'm extremely okay with these Hall of Fame attires. I'm just saying. The looks have been served, as some would say. All right, come on. Yeah. Oh, damn. She countered us, though. All right. Bro, Becky's hair on that model is lit, too. Damn, we almost fell off the stage. Can y'all relax? Oh, upsy days it downs it wound. I kind of want to know what happens if you go over to Joe. <laughs> like, does he just murder Trey? <laughs> but I also don't want to lose, so that's why I'm just not. But I do really want to know what would happen. 
Oh, God. No, no, no. There we go. Oh, nice mid move, too. Standing shooting star at the Hall of Fame. Oh, big forearm. Really? And now Brooklyn Von Braun. Okay. Okay. This is just cheap. Oh, we're going to throw me off the stage. Is that what I just heard? Is that what I just heard? Wait, what? What are they? Oh, you hate to see that battery level low, though. Oh, God! You're a Nagi! Off the stage! Oh, my God! We just got killed. Oh, they got the list. No, 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 no! Oh! Y'all some assholes. Y'all some assholes. Do you need me to make another ice machine run? You know, there's some wounds that ice can't heal. <laughs> <laughs> what? You, you have to admit, that was a pretty cheesy line. <laughs> you know, you have a really strange way of apologizing. I'm sorry. It's just... We've been working through this all night, and I think I'm starting to lose it. <laughs> Look, you know how I truly feel. You also know me better than anyone else. I made a stupid decision to protect you when we were kids, and it just kept escalating from there. I wanted to tell you so many times, but it got harder and harder, especially when you started leaving the tickets. I couldn't bring myself to take that away from you. It would be like you finding out that America's Next Top hand model was fixed. Wait, is it? Did you hear something? <laughs> no. I was just using that as an example. Oh, okay. Because I don't think I could handle that right now. I think I always knew deep down that it was all too good to be true. That I'd never meet them. But... I guess a part of me wanted to believe that maybe something bigger would come out of all of this. That it wasn't just about action figures or championships or entertaining millions of people. That it would help me find a part of myself that was missing. But maybe something bigger did come out of all of this. This wasn't about finding two people who would fill a hole in your life. It was about millions of people finding you to fill holes in their lives. <laughs> now that was cheesy <laughs> but it's true <laughs> maybe I have something for you please don't tell me this is a letter from my long lost aunt and uncle telling me to forgive my best friend <laughs> just open it what's this all about it's our new list on one of my ice machine runs, or maybe it was one of the times you locked me out of the room, I can't remember, but I made some phone calls to management, and it's unprecedented, but they've agreed to let us get revenge on Brooklyn and Samoa Joe at tomorrow night's WrestleMania, assuming you're on board. I guess we're coming out of retirement. This has to be some kind of record. <laughs> There's one other thing you need to know. Brooklyn and Samoa Joe agreed to the match, but only if we put our Hall of Fame spots on the line. What? You really want to do this? If we don't fight back after what they did, then we don't deserve those spots. Package deal. I'm in. Hey, just wanted to let you know, I left two open seats in the audience just like you always did. Why? I mean, obviously, my birth parents aren't showing up anytime soon. So was it just for good luck or out of respect or something? You'll see. What? All right, guys, that's going to wrap it up for this one. And I think it's pretty much 
safe to assume that on the next episode, we are going to have the finale of the My Career series. So if you enjoyed this episode, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If you are new, hit that bell. So you we upload. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video. And as always and forever, take it easy though, guys. Peace.